y'all forgot to vlog. Today is Thursday. Mamas is back. Say hi, mamas. Hey, y'all. I'm back. Okay, so now we can go back to our regular vlogging schedule because you know we was on a skimp schedule because mamas was gone. And um, yeah, so we came to this Indian restaurant called Planet Bombay. It's off Moreland. We've been here oh, before. It's good. It's good. Good, good, good. Yeah, it's good. good. So, how was uh, your Valentine? Just ask her. She had a Valentine. I didn't. Oh, that? <laughs> oh that's fine. It was good. Hey, Valentine, not a good lover. Valentine for your issue. You love your mommy. Yeah, exactly. You love your daddy. Exactly. You love your children. This is also love. It's not for like a man and woman. It's yeah. not oh, okay. You know, I didn't know your, that part. Call your mama because she gave you birth and she was painful. Yeah, I've seen her yesterday. That's good. That's all. <laughs> if you make your mommy happy, that's good. Men, women, to me, I believe this. Men and women come and go, mm, but family do. forever. Yeah. yeah okay, for the inspiration. Yeah, put you on the spot real quick. Anyway, that's not the kind of Valentine I'm ever looking for. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so we had an Indian restaurant. We got chicken samosas, chicken, I mean shrimp puri, and then we got this dish called malai. It's a type of curry with like a coconut and ginger. I seen it on like TikTok or something earlier today and I was like oh this shit look good I gotta eat it so we ordered that we've been here before and the food was really good so we just decided to come back and I have to go home and do some work on the computer do some people taxes and stuff so yeah I'll show you how the food when it get here though the camera finna die mama's is enjoying the food so much it's fresh just like you said yeah, this is a chicken samosa. We had two of them, and it's like a little mint chutney. They're gonna mind. I only took two bites because I still want to eat the shrimp pori and the other meal that we got. And there goes the mango juice. It's so good. This is the shrimp pori. This is so good. It's like a big puffer thingy, and it has a shrimp inside. It's so freaking good. Okay, y'all, this is the shrimp malai curry. And this is the rice. Of course, we didn't eat all our food, but we're definitely gonna eat it because tonight we gotta go work, so we'll have something to eat. So let's try it. Oh, let's try it. I'm so excited. Ooh, these shrimp big. They're bigger than that little appetizer shrimp. Mm -hmm. I just hope it's good. Mm -hmm. An impasse. It's called an impasse. <laughs> And you're too much of it because too much? Yeah, I mean what can you do? You can only do so much. People gotta help themselves. Alright y'all, let's try it. In this bite I got shrimp, rice, and the sauce. Okay, it's good. I would like it to be a little more sweet. I need to start eating more Indian food because it be vegan. It reminds me of the puri. Y'all, the camera's still finna die. I brought it with me and forgot to vlog because me and Rodney went to Kroger and I was on TikTok Live with red and we was battling so i didn't even get the rodney please yes i didn't even get to battle like i wanted to i mean i think i just seen a bug <gasps> a bug ah! y'all it was a bug ew y'all it's a freaking bug and Rodney just cleaned it. Ugh. Didn't even get to vlog like I wanted to because I was on TikTok live with them. Something smells good. So, yeah, y'all. But we just came back from Kroger, had to get some bread. So I'm finna do some people's taxes. And then head out to go cook. What's up, y'all? Today is Friday. So, um... I'm about to go get stretched. I need a massage, really, but my lower back and my hips is so tight. So I'm about to go get stretched. I found this guy. I think his name is like Stretch Therapy ATL. So we're going to go get stretched from him. And um going to get my, get gas in the truck. And then we come back home. Got people taxes to do. So 
yeah we're gonna get started on that we don't got no gas in the truck y'all like none like look no freaking gas in the truck so i'm gonna just put a little bit of gas in it and then i'm gonna go to sam's club and fill it up the rest of the way but the place the stretch therapy place is only um three miles away six miles away so i doubt we'll run out but i'm gonna just put a little more in there just in case so that when i'm done i can go straight to sam's okay y'all we here it's inside here so i know this is kind of like dark lights and stuff so i'm gonna go inside and see what it's looking like and i'll show y'all what i can okay i'm so ready to get stretched out y'all my body be hurting it be aching actually y'all that's the wrong building <laughs> ah, that's the wrong door on the suite okay we got to come down here and this is why you got to read the directions but y'all my back and body be hurting so bad i be trying to stretch every day but i need to get back into it like i just be doing a quick little stretch but i be needing to do like a real deal um a real deal when like assisted with some structure okay y'all now we made it we are here okay y'all this is it we are here okay y'all we just got here we have to sign in and stuff we can do a waiver so that's what we're doing Okay, let me show y'all what it looks like. Okay, so this is it. And they said the trainer is going to come down soon. And you can hear you signing at the front desk. They got a sign. Don't play with them. Period. Okay, y'all. Okay, we made it. Okay, y'all, so I'm going to just get y'all a little bit of footage at the end because I can't leave the camera running the whole time like it's going to die. <laughs> I only got 35 minutes left on the SD card, so screen in here. Yeah. All right, y'all, so we almost done getting some footage for y'all. That's the sign. So I'm going to set the camera up so y'all can see a little bit. There we go. All the magic go. I followed the rules and told you everything you had to know. Had you over every night. Every night was passionate. Plus, you met my mother, even if it was an accident. I'm confused. Tell me. Okay, y'all. Everything was good. We done. Feel so good. We still got some errands on. Yes, I enjoyed. Ten out of ten. Highly recommend. Until next time. Until next time. I will come back the week after next, but I'm gonna be in Florida, so it's gonna have to be. Am I gonna be in Florida? Yeah, I'm gonna be in Florida. Oh no, I'll, I'll be here on the first. I don't leave to the second. I might come back on that Friday. We're gonna see. All right, y'all. I was gonna get some wings, but I don't need wings. So we at Starbucks. We're gonna get us a dopio. this y'all oleato i wonder is it just a type of coffee or is it a syrup hmm. hey i got a question this oleato is it a syrup or is it just a type of coffee you said is it a syrup or a type of what a type of coffee Oh yeah, okay. So I can get syrup. Okay. I do like the shake and espresso version, but I'm not a big fan of coffee, so I add white milk in the 
Okay, I like, um, what I wanted is a dopio, and I wanted to see if I could get that, however y'all could put the Olato in it. Can you do that with a dopio? So, you, I could do that, but you have to get like a steamed milk with it for me to do with the olive oil in it. Um, okay, but can it or be like, cold? Yeah, so then we can do like a golden foam on there, which is basically just the olive oil's pumpkin sauce mixture foam. Yeah. Blend that up and put that on top. Yeah, okay, girl, you know what you're talking about. Yes. <laughs> okay. okay, I want a dopio blonde. Okay. With um whatever you just said. Okay, you and want flavor in there? Yeah, I want caramel. Can you put it in a venti cup with ice, please? Are we adding like, you said caramel, right? Yeah, caramel, mm-hmm. In the drink, right? Yeah, in the, in the dopio, mm-hmm. Okay, how many shots of caramel you want? Um, let me get like four or five. Right. Five is good, okay. Now, do you want any milk? Added? No milk, I'm, no I'm milk gonna put my milk. own, mm-hmm. And then, y'all okay. got this vanilla bean custard Danish? Uh, no, actually, I don't have that one right Oh now. my God, I wanted to try it, I ain't never heard of it. I know. Dang. All right, I'll just take the drink. Okay. All right, that's 625. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all, she knew what she was talking about, honey. So I got this Oleato, Olato, whatever the fuck. We're going to try it. I am a coffee girl. I love me some coffee. Y'all, I just went and got that stretch from Hassan. Y'all, don't play with him. Don't play with her son, period. Y'all, the stretch, I feel so good. Like, body just moves and just feeling like one of them ones. I just feel so good and like relieved and like tension free and stuff. Like, y'all, I feel so good. He did a really good job. Really nice, professional, neat, clean. He is not one of them ones. Like, y'all, we gotta take care of our bodies. We getting old. I'm 29. I'm gonna be 30. Oh my gosh. Like, I need to enjoy 29. I need to enjoy this last year of my 20s. And like, I need to take care of my body. We all need to take care of our bodies, okay? But I just really need to take care of my body because like, you know, it's been overweight for so long and so many other different things. So yeah, y'all, we need to take care of our bodies, treat our bodies right. And don't disappoint our bodies um it's hard it is hard and it's just so much stuff to do in life like it's so much stuff to do all the time right like you never can catch a freaking break but you still gotta you gotta take care of yourself because you only get one body like now if you could buy a body like you can build a body girl dog it out get you another one but you can't get stuck with the same one forever Y'all look at my hair. My ponytail was so cute when I first did it. Now nah, it's giving Harriet Tubman. But whatever, that don't matter. Well, that don't, it don't matter. Anyways, that's what we're saying. Take care of your body, y'all. I'm starting to learn that. You know, I want to get more into taking care of my body. I'm definitely going to go a more holistic route with a lot of different stuff. Like starting with my washing powder. I am gonna. I'm about to run out of washing powder. And I'm gonna go to Sprouts and get this um natural washing powder and it only has like three ingredients in it and i can't wait to use it um because i'm thinking about it, like our skin is the largest organ we wash our clothes with like these fabric softeners and detergents that have all these chemicals and stuff in it like it's no way you should still be smelling the chemical four weeks after you don't put it on if you wash some clothes and you don't wear it for four weeks it still got the fragrance of the uh washing powder in it like that's crazy that's crazy like that's not good like why should a chemical still be smelling aromatic and fragrant four weeks later like and then we putting that on our skin our skin is absorbing all of that like you know we gotta think about that kind of stuff then like what really made me think about is like your vagina like you're washing your drawers and you putting this strong chemical right on your coochie come on now come on now y'all gotta think about it think about it so yeah i'm gonna start with that um my lotions and stuff i love perfume but i can do without like fragrances soaps but i do be trying different soaps i use black soap too um uh, raw black soap so like i'm just trying to get rid of as many additives as i can in life that's what we need to do we all need to do it 
That was you on the thing at first? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I had no clue. It's all right. It's new, well, you know it's the new drink. So. Yeah, I haven't so. seen it. You had it? You don't like it? I like olive oil. Me either. That's all I was like. I hope she don't ask me how it tastes good. No, I be like when people tell me the truth, though. Yeah, I was gonna put some. We can't have it on our syrup. Right, so Y'all, we gonna see how this drink tastes. And you know, we're gonna put the protein shake in it. No milk. You get your protein shake and you throw your protein shake in there. Y'all know how this goes. I'm a content creator, so y'all get to see that. This finger is cut the heck up. I cut my finger so bad, y'all. It's embarrassing how bad I cut my finger. Sliced the heck it. Did it in. Nasty. The way I cut my finger. Okay, y'all. I'm going to show y'all when I get to drink. And we're going to finish our conversation about growing up and taking care of our bodies. Alright, this is how it came. Cause the Olato is apparently olive oil infused milk. So this is how it came already. And this is the Dopio with the blonde and golden foam was what they called it. Um, so this is the order. I'm just gonna try the foam itself first with olive oil in it. Mm. Mmm, I like it. Mmm. -hmm. It does give it a velvety, rich, smooth taste. Y'all don't mind that. That's just my phone falling. So y'all know what we do. <laughs> You know how this go. Y'all not new to this. Y'all true to this. Now we're going to stir it up. I'm so goddamn hungry. I'm on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm hungry like a 13. And it's not the hungry like y'all people know. It's a BSG hungry. Ooh. It don't taste like no blonde, but I can tell it is blonde because it's not that dark, but it don't taste like it. See y'all, you don't have to give up everything when you um bariatric. <sighs> All right, y'all. Let's put Sam's Club in the GPS. It's probably going to take 30 minutes. Hold on, y'all. Let's see.
27 minutes, but we need gas. We gots to go. We gots to go, y'all. We can't not go. So, 285 to Riverdale Road. Let me see. Is that the way that I want to go? Because, let me tell you one thing about the GPS. It'll have you doing stuff you don't want to do. Yeah, 285 to Riverdale Road. It's an accident, y'all. So, you know, words of my good friend Red. Hold this ride. Okay, y'all. We at the gas pump at Sam's. So I do the um app thing to pay for my gas. Well, you scan the code. So you just go in the app, and then you hit fuel, and then you scan it. And that's it. Let's pump the gas. Okay, y'all, now we're gonna go in Sam's Club. We only need one thing, which is some bell peppers. So let's go in there. When I come in here, they got this orange juice, y'all. They make this fresh squeezed orange juice. Y'all, it's so good. And it's $10 for a little small bottle. Y'all, it's top tier, immaculate. Some of the best orange juice you're gonna ever have in your goddamn motherfucking life. You hear me? So let's go ahead and go in here. All right, y'all. This is what we came for. <laughs> we only got three bags left. They got a couple of different salads in here, y'all. Sweet kale, Santa Fe, Southwest, Caesar. And then they got this one over here, this Ultimate Cheddar Ranch. I wasn't a big fan of it. These are all cheap, too. Two and three dollars. Y'all, they got these Chobani protein shakes for $10 or $11. Come in strawberry and mixed berry vanilla. That's good, 20 grams of protein. But I do not like Greek yogurt, so I won't be getting it. Y'all, look at these protein pancakes. $13. Premier protein pancakes. Okay, and in microwave, Ooh, don't play with it. <laughs> I wouldn't eat it, but. And they got these acai bowls. And I did need some olive oil, y'all, so I got it. Because mine at home is pretty much empty. I need some more grapeseed oil for cooking. But I don't see any. So we probably have to get that from Costco's. Which is where we get it from now. Y'all, the camera was dead, and somehow I just kept forgetting to pick it up. Um, so yeah, today is Saturday night. Um, I'm just straightening up the living room a little bit, and I'm gonna go upstairs and go to sleep. I'm not really gonna clean, clean. We're just gonna straighten it up somewhat, and yeah, just straighten it up so it doesn't look so bad. We were down here watching TV. It's like ten pair of shoes down here and stuff like that. Just gonna straighten up a little bit because in the morning I'm gonna get up and go to Costco and go run some errands and I just don't want to look at this in the morning. So y'all can just watch me clean. Oh, 
Okay, y'all, so we just straightened up the living room. I mean, it's basic in here. All I did was fold up the clothes. They still there. <laughs> Didn't put them away, only folded them up and swept the floor took everything off the couch and just put most of it on the desk that's enough it's just straightening up you know so it's not so messy the shoe rack i just put all the shoes on there i didn't really straighten them up i just put them up on there to get them off the floor so i could sweep you know just a little straighten up not a clean like you know when you clean you organize everything whatever but i'm not doing it at night it's not even night it's like almost six o'clock in the morning so i need to go lay down um so yeah